now as you've seen we're gonna be now as you've seen we're gonna make a portal inside After Effects now of course what you're gonna need is After Effects primary it's gonna be primarily After Effects because the plugin we're using is for After Effects but I'm sure you can get a similar product using another editing software like HitFilm so now what you're gonna need is uh, After Effects or another editing software so to start off we're gonna come back inside After Effects go import file and then you gotta find your um, green screen and then import again and find your background there it is and then import again file and then find your well, wherever the portal is going to for me it's just outside and then I'm gonna bring in portal outside underneath portal and then background and so now you want to find out where so once you got these imported you want to find where your um, subject enters the frame so now you want to find the area where your subject summons the portal there you go that's good now you want to make a new solid by right clicking here new solid make it black um, and then you can just name this uh, saber last name saber and now you want to put saber underneath the portal now you've got your subject here and you want to hit control space to get the effects console and you want to type in saber to get the saber effect now you've got this nice blue saber this is obviously made for lightsabers but it's got a lot of uses so we can use it for a portal too so um, to make it to make it the shape of a portal you want to go to wrong button you want to hit uh, this pencil make it make a little point click above your head above the subjects above the subject um, wherever you want it and I'm just gonna make this nice right there just and to stop that from happening you just drag this back up need to be perfect it's, it's a portal as you'll see it's pretty ran it's gonna be pretty random um, and then you, oh, and then you want to click back on this part oops click on that part and then click back on this part finish out the portal so now you've got your portal shape to make it conform to the shape customize core go to, click on the saver and click on layer masks now you've got it around your subject now to make um, your background appear you just hit you go from normal to screen and there you go you can see your background and now as you can see it's not where exactly where you want where we want it to be so you just click on the saber and I'm gonna put it where the mo where the wall meets the ground just to make it look like that's where you that's what's happening with me there we go that should look good okay just to make it look like it's on the wall and now what you want to do is go to preset um, and click on burning okay so what you want to do is find the point you already at well you should be already be at the point where your subject so summons the portal and so then you go into effects saber customize core and you go to start offset make a little make a key point to click this clock and then make it sit and then drag your pointer little timeline thing to where you want it to be or you want the just a few frames afterwards in it and make a key point by clicking this little diamond and actually you want to come back to this first one 
and make start offset 100% because so, you want it to appear so now the thing's gone and then I want to come back over here and make this 50% this is how I did it this is, this is how making them come down and meet in the center over here um, so to make it meet in the middle what I did was I clicked on saber hit control D which made du duplicates and then uh, you right click on one of them and then transform flip horizontal now you've got two of them but the other one but one of those flipped what you need now is where you're going so so I'm going to take go down here you just wrap that up um, take the mask from here control C and then control V right there now as you can see we've got roughly what the portal is going to look like we, you just have to do a little touching up you should have once you're done pretty nice looking portal effect what you want to do is come in here find the key points keyframes on it um, and then go to background masks and then find opacity hit this little thing this little keyframe make it right here and bring it to zero then you find your other mask your other key point on it and bring it all the way to 100 now it forms it f gets fully formed when the portal is fully formed and that's how it's made